in, a, in, in India. We just come back from India. We had two tours in India in the last three months, which is a mind-blowing experience, of course. Not you. <laughs> mind-blowing. Uh, and so there is a god named Hanuman, a very big god, very famous. You know, one of, not one of the tiny gods, a big one, very famous. Um, and uh, Hanuman was like a, the son of the wind. And the gypsies like to call themselves the children of the wind. So I think this is where the connection is. This is my take on it. It's a non-official take, okay? <laughs> but uh, it's just a, a projection. I think Django heard about Hanuman. Probably also because in that time period in France, in Paris, there was a lot of occultism and stuff. Like There was also a lot of like uh, hermetic okay. stuff going on. There's a lot of things, you know, Indian, philosophy and stuff. So you probably heard of Hanuman, the god who was the child of the wind. And he was like, oh, we're the children of the wind too. So he probably wrote a, 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 a song for the child of the wind. That's my take on it. Now, I'm probably completely wrong, but that's okay. I like to think that it's a good story. And uh, we also come, just come back from India, as I say, and we played it last time in a, in a, in a Hanuman temple. So it was maybe the first time it was performed live in India, I don't know. But we're gonna play it now. Hanuman. <laughs>
Thank you.